Hey Cincy fam, editing Eileen here. I just wanted to hop on quick before my video starts. I just wanted to address my giveaway. A lot of people, I've seen a lot of comments that they have not, they weren't entered into my giveaway. I guess a lot of people did not see or go to my link down in that July's with box video that they had to make themselves seen so I can see who subscribed on YouTube. I can see your comments and I can see that you comment on something, but if you like something or um, just you don't want to be seen, you have it set in your privacy settings, I can't see it. Uh, I can only see certain comments. So I do want to make it right because um, that's just the type of person I am. I want to make it right. So I have two options for this. Um, for people that are subscribed and they did not make themselves seen or the people that are subscribed and they did not get a chance to email me because everything was linked down and below. So I want to correct it two ways. Number one, the winner and her and the gift is right there has, has not claimed their prize and they do have a couple days. Um, if in, in the couple days they do not contact me to claim the prize right here because it's not signed, sealed, and delivered yet because once they claim it and I get all the information, I want to put ice packs in there because I do have wax and I do not want you guys to get some kind of spillage or nasty wax because of this great heat that we're having. So if the winner does not claim their prize, I will do it all over again. I will not only do it by the people that are visible, by the people that did e email me because I did save my emails, but also I will add comments for this prize if option one goes correctly. If she does not claim it. If she claims it, we will go to option two. Option two is I do have another uh, warmer I can give away that is brand new in the box. I have several warmers that I haven't even opened because I collect. So I can put another little giveaway together with for my people. And not only will I do it for who is subscribed, but I think we're just going to just do just straight comments. I think comments may be just a little bit easier. This is my first giveaway ever to on a different platform. And so this is my experience with it. It didn't go as smooth as I hoped it would, but I do want to correct it. So option one is we will redo this giveaway if it the prize is not claimed. Option two is if she is, if the prize is claimed, I do have another giveaway. It will be in an upcoming video. I don't know which one yet because I don't know which option I'm doing yet. So keep an eye out on future videos on what I'm going to do. So either way, there will be a second prize um, or a first prize with comments because a lot of people couldn't make themselves um, seen. So I just wanted to address it real quick. So you guys enjoy the video. Uh -oh. yeah. Scentsy fam, it's Eileen, your independent Scentsy consultant, and today we are going to unbox the cars warmer. I've got my little guest with me, Hi. and so let's open it. I was super excited. This is actually his warmer, so go ahead and hold it up, bud. It's the cars warmer. Look at how cute this packaging is, you guys. They never skip on it. Scentsy is great at it so these just came in I have a huge box here behind me um, I closed out a party actually and I had to already unbox everything because I had customers who really really wanted their stuff and I don't blame them because I always want my stuff so tales from radiator springs how cute is that I was super excited um, the boy loves cars my daughters, uh, they semi liked cars when it was when it first came out, and oh, we got some stuff in here. What is this? Oh, we got a little um, Route sixty six sign. Isn't that cute? To put with the sense, put so, it on its sensey. I don't even know what kind of warmer this is. I don't know if it's bulb or oh, it's element. Answered my question right now. My own question. So I was kind of iffy about this warmer just because I don't, I didn't feel like we got like a whole lot of information on it on our workstation. 
I didn't know if they were cars like actually on there or if they were hand painted, but so it's an element warmer. It is hand painted. These are actually on this whole unit. So it's not like a car that pops out. It is totally smooth, hand painted on there. It is an element warmer. On the back, you have your light indicator. So this will turn red when your warmer is clicked on from your mechanism here. And we also have a divot for our cord. So that's nice so that your when it's on its surface, the warmer will not be wobbly as long as you have your cord and the cord divot here. So that is the car's warmer. So let's get the little plate on. What do you think of it, bud? It's awesome and I'm the little person right away. Yeah, so it's, it has no light. Right now he has the Marvel warmer um, with, it's really, it's a super bright glass warmer. So here's our dish, it's radiator springs. Um, it is ceramic, it's a ceramic dish with the coating on it. That's really cute. I personally do like uh, ceramic warmers. I feel like they get hot, a little bit more warm, and it throws better your scent. So this sits, oh, not like I could break it, didn't I? I always break my stuff. So it sits right on there. Looks like the epic rocks from the movie. And oh, we wait, have, on the, oh. It says Radiator Springs. Oh. Okay, so let's see the little sign. Where do we put, oh, we put it here. So there's a little notch to put, oh my God, hopefully you don't. This is like a Mission Impossible. You can't get it open? Yeah. All right, so let's see if we can get it open. Three hours later. We did it. We did it real good. We put it in there. So you stick your little Route 66 sign. I think it's so cute. Um, Route 66 does come where I'm at in California. We do have a Route 66 here. We are part of it. And there you go with your little Route 66 sign. It's really, really cute. Like I said, these are hand painted on there. They don't pop out. They're, they're not individual cars on your warmer. They are totally painted on. But I think this is so, so cute. Isn't this like a beaut? But that's our car's warmer. And we also got, um, let me put this down carefully. Dear God, I'm gonna break it on me. Oh. All right, we also got the scent, the Radiator Spring scent. It's like, I think it's lemon, pink grapefruit, cherries, and sugar. I personally, I get a lot of lemon, more like squeeze the day uh, lemon. That smells like blueberry. Poopery, it smells like citrus. I would put this in the citrus category. Um, I would not put it in fruity because it smells a lot like squeeze the day with with sugar, bright grapefruit. I don't get any cherry now, which I wish I did because I love I love cherries. Cherries is my absolute favorite. It smells it's a little it's a little glossy. It's a little glossy. It came in my bags. I have tons of bags here. But I like it. It smells like a medium performer. Haven't obviously haven't warmed it yet, so hopefully soon I'll be doing like a scent review on that. But because I got this big box, I closed out a party, and because we, oh my god, I'm moving the camera. Oh my god, I'm gonna knock stuff down. So because it is transition month in July, as of right now, everything is 10% off on not everything, almost everything is 10% off on the website. I stocked up on bars, and I wanted to show you what I stocked up on. So. I got this Mylar bag. Every time you and like pull up this something. one's huge. This Mylar bag full of wax. So I did want to show you guys what I got. So we got tons of wax. So I do want to go through some of the wax. I also did get the little Scentsy uh, bracelets. Don't move that. I did get the Scentsy bracelets. Um, these aren't mine. I'm giving them to my uh, my two daughters because they like that kind of stuff. So we got. A lot of bars. Two aloe vera and ivy. I am going to go over in another video of like what's retiring, what um, for the fall catalog. I do want to go over what's retiring. So I'm going to try not to keep on saying this is not coming, this is not coming. But I do love aloe vera and ivy. And the way we transition. So August we will be getting our new catalog in. All the fall um, scents. I love fall. 
I'm excited for what's coming. But my problem is, is here where I live in California, we are freaking hot in October. So I don't start burning fall scents until like the end of October, like around Halloween, we will start getting cooler. In September, we are still hot. So I needed to stock up on a lot of scents that I can still um, melt while we're in the fall catalog. So two aloe vera and ivy. Do you like that one, bud? And also happy 4th of the July. Oh, it is 4th of July. Happy 4th of July, everybody. We got sea salt and avocado. I can't live without sea salt and avocado. I love this scent. Um, I keep on saying that it's between that and prickly pear and agave. That one's the winner for me. That's Strawberry fresh. rose. That's fresh. Yeah, that's the fresh avocado, you call it. Fresh avocado. We got free, free avocado. Uh, palm trees and ocean breeze. So I'm dumb. I'm going to tell you guys why I'm dumb. I said this was in my club. I looked at my club. It's not there. So I, I don't know what I did. I edit it every day. I must have taken it out and not put it back in. So I'm a little bummed. So I'm now I'm holding on to my bars. So palm trees and ocean breeze. That is a good one. Wait. Plumeria peach. I love plumeria peach. It says it's strawberry, but it smells like chocolate. Oh, you think strawberry rose smells like chocolate? I smell it. I love strawberry rose. I think it smells like rose. Oh, I think it, oh, I just love this. This is such a unique scent. I this might have to go in my club. I'm not sure. But we got red pear and pomegranate. This did not go in my club because I have a whole brick of it plus extra. But this one's so juicy, so fruity. I got a bar of Perfect Gentleman. Nobody really likes masculine scents in my house, but I thought this one smelled really, really it's fresh so and really, really nice. Our dad loves. Masculine. Oh, I got another palm trees and ocean breeze. Obviously, I was smart. I stocked up. This is masculine. Another plumeria peach. I really love this peach. Did you this buy is. Two of them? I, I guess I must have gotten two of them. Oh, my light just went out. Well, gotta keep on pushing through. So we got two Fiji flower. I I don't know why I got more of these. I guess I'm stocking up. I like Fiji flower. It will not be going in my club. Um, nobody liked it but me. We got a lot of bring back my bars. I had to stock up before the 30th hit. That's like a so, strong smell of coconut. I think it's flower and apple, son. So we got French Kiss. This is in my club, but I did have to get another one. What's this? My wish? Yeah. Ooh. Mm-hmm. That's like the smell, right? <laughs> right? My wish in my club, but I had to get more. Oh, popping those open. Like when Love Story. When you oh when when I open like um Sensi and smell them, some of these like they have a familiar scent to me. Like I know, like you like, smelled it before. Like I've smelled like oh my gosh I've smelled this from like a familiar food or a drink or something like that. Oh, so it gives you like a scent memory. It gives me like a memory of what I've smelled before. We got Honeymoon Hideaway. Actually, we got two Honeymoon Hideaway. It's in my club, but still, got it. always got to stock up. Oh, that's like minty. Kahikahula, you guys. I know, I know. I love Kahikahula. You guys are going to be sick of me talking about it. I love Kahikahula. That one just, it reminds me dead of Hawaii when She'll I went. She'll die for this. Uh... What is this? Lucky in Love. I did. I did not put this in my club. Oh, you don't like Kahiko Hula? Does it smell good? Oh, it smells so fruity. What's this guy talking about? Okay. This is fruity right here. We got Coffee Tree in my club as well, but I needed more. I love this sound. Uh, Watermelon Patch. So, I did not care for Watermelon Patch on its own. In fact, I don't even think it really smells great on cold, but when you mix this with like lemon sorbet or squeeze the day and you get that like watermelon lemonade, I love it. I, I like it. Didn't go in my club. It's going to stay probably I like in cookies. my stock and I'll maybe use it next. Oh, I got two of them. Two watermelon patches. Literally, mm. I want a coffee It'll stay in my warmer, but, but she's like, no, you're not You're not getting some in your warmer. You're getting Oh, you wanted stuff. coffee tree in your I want this. I okay, want we'll it. put it in your warmer. Because like my sister always needs coffee for me when mom's away. It, it happens. They These kids, they plot against me. It, it we got happens. another My Wish. 
we got another Lucky in Love. And we got Sweet Pea and Vanilla. I should have more of this. So I ended up loving Sweet Pea and Vanilla. It did not go in my club because I'm the only one that likes it. So when I'm the only one that likes it, I can only warm it on certain days when no one's home or people are tolerable of it. We have too many bars. I got another Love Story. I got two Blue Hyacinth. I love this. I love it for the bathroom. It's amazing. I It just didn't go in my club because, again, I'm the only one who who likes it. We got the two faves. My Wish and Kahiko Hula. More of these. You guys, these bars are stacking up. I got a lot of bars. Oh, wow. We Thank got you. two Ocean. I love Ocean. It's I believe this one's in my monthly club because I love it that much. We got Jet Set Go. So what Jet Set Go is going to do for me is it's going to sit and then we're going to see how the performance is. There's so much so, bars that it's falling Yeah, things. I don't want it to like fall down. Okay, we got a Rockin' Ruby Raz. I ended up really liking this. Again, I'm going to see how they sit. And I think most of these scents were pretty popular they may come back i mean i took a chance on it so if i didn't put it in my club this is um, good blue hyacinth yeah that one's good for the bathroom read it we got white mm. tea and cactus another rock and ruby raz another sweet pea and vanilla so Wait. again this is what i just was stocking up on that that smells good what is this rock and ruby raz i put that in your room we got uh, fresh cut daisies. Again, I like these kind of strong florals in my bathroom. I love aquatics in my bathroom, but I think I only did get one of those. Um, it was okay. If it didn't have that sharp green note, I think I would have gotten more. We have another ocean. Not that awesome. We got summer soleil. So summer soleil, again, it's going to sit for a while and then I'm gonna check the performance. I did not this, this one in Jet Set Go, nothing. Absolutely I nothing. I don't smell anything in Ocean. We got Black Wild Cherry. So this is in my club, made it in my club. I got another one because um, it's not that I need to stock up on it. I only use one cube and it blows out my whole house. How many rocking wooden roses oh, did you get? Our write? second light went out. Oh, we got to charge it. So thank God we're almost done. So Black Wild Cherry is in my club. Next we also got another yeah. blue hyacinth. Oh my god, I think I got like four. And then we got two white tea and cactus. So I stocked up. Yeah, because that one didn't go in my club. White tea and cactus did not go in my club, so I stocked up. And last but not least, right? Yes. Uh, watermelon mint. So I'm going to let this sit and see if this also gives me a little bit of better performance. Because I do like it. It smells like fresh watermelon. I don't get much of a minty note but it only lasts one day. So I was gonna see maybe if it gets a little bit better over time. So those are the ones I stocked up on from my um, from my party and it's a lot. Okay. Anyway, thank you Scentsy Fan. Thanks for watching us, spending some time with us. I really truly appreciate it. If you guys have any comments, wanna give me any feedback on some of these or what you've experienced with these, comment down below. Thanks Scentsy Fan. Catch Happy you on the next one. July. Happy 4th of July.